Hello and welcome to Vincenzo's channel. Arte Prespiali Salomoni. My name is Friday and I am Vincenzo's personal assistant. I take care of the English language versions of this channel. Let me know in the comments if my language is good and don't forget to subscribe to the channel to help Vincenzo's channel. In this video Vincenzo will show you how to paint a white fountain all in foam with very few color. Sometimes the white is a color that is not easy to apply. Bianco Titanio, Bianco Opaco, there are too much but every white is different. If you will arrive at the end of the video Vincenzo will show you how to smudge the white to make it even more realistic. After applying a coat of black let the fountain dry. Then we dilute the Vallejo stone grey. With a not too small brush we apply this extra coat to soften the shadows. Alternatively, you can cover the structure directly with a medieval grey. In this case, however, you will have less shadows on the fountain. With the rest of the stone grey add some white titanium in the same container. Do not wait for the stone grey to be completely dry. Apply a second base coat with a damp brush. White and stone grey will mix again creating numerous shades depending on the texture of the fountain. To obtain natural shades, the coats of color should be applied with the previous color still wet. Now is the time for the natural sienna. Always in the same container. After application, the stone will take on a warmer, almost salmon pink color. At the beginning of the video I promised you that Vincenzo would show you how to make white more realistic. Here's how Vincenzo works. Let the fountain dry for about 30 minutes. The time that the colors are dry. With acrylic paints it doesn't take long. To bring out the white and make it more realistic with a dry brush, apply yellow in the points where you want to emphasize the processing of the texture. The most important points will be the intersections between the stones. You may be thinking, but where is the white? Before applying the white to give the rocks a truly realistic color, Vincenzo applies a very diluted coat of walnut colored impregnating agent. It is used for the aging of wood and surfaces. Vincenzo often uses this technique and if you want to know more visit his YouTube channel to find out how he uses this impregnating agent. Before passing the white, Vincenzo uses paper to remove the excess impregnating agent, the more superficial one. It is time for white. Before the fountain dries completely, little by little, apply the white. You will see that it will get dirty in such a realistic way that no other white will like it.
Here is the first step of coloring the fountain that is drying. If you liked the video, leave a like and if you haven't done so yet, subscribe to the channel. Let Vincenzo know if you knew this technique and how you make white more realistic. Vincenzo will be happy to answer you in the comments. Tick the bell to receive all notifications on future content and live shows.